wanted to do my October Star Look Starbucks and you have been with me for a while you know that I've been doing reviews about Starbucks for quite a while and I do normally like the boxes um, a lot of times when you get subscription boxes you get like a few things that you do like and some that you don't like you're not always going to please everybody so normally I find one or two things that I really love so in this box there were three things in this box that I did receive and normally you get about three to four full-size products and it is completely full-size products they are not sample sized at all and that's what's really great about this one so the retail value of this particular box of October is $73 and you can judge for yourself what you feel about that and I'll tell you my feelings about it as well so the first thing that I received was this Tender Gloss Lipstick in Fuzzy Puzzy. So Puzzy. I have a hard time pronouncing this without it being very inappropriate. So I always say Fuzzy and then Puzzy because I don't know. Yeah, so Puzzy is the name of this lipstick. It is, um, I'd actually not even say that this is a lipstick. It's more like a lip gloss. And it has these like metallic type of color to it um, you can barely even see it you can see like this little sheen of like an iridescent color but it's not chunky at all it serves more as a lip gloss than anything so that's the first thing and this lip tender gloss retails for $13 so the next thing I received was this diamond pencil in Mirage and I've already received one of their gem pencils before and I love them. I use them as a base to any color that I need. Um, so I have like a lavender one and I use that as a base for my lavender eyeshadows. Um, I have a green one, same thing. I use it over green or under green just as a base to make my colors just pop. And this one is silver, which is really nice. It'll be great for the holidays. Um, just under my grays or even just a dark charcoal type of color So really nice color as you can see it's really smooth really pigmented and I Love these gem pencils they are gorgeous. They do blend pretty well So it's not entirely meant for just use as an eyeliner So it will kind of go all over the place if you use it for that purpose um, Some people use it just for the waterline but I normally don't because, I don't know, for me, anything on my waterline that is glitterily, glittery like that normally makes, just gets all over the place and I don't like it. So this is great as just a base for, for me. And this retails for $14, which is typical for a, an eyeliner pencil. Now the next thing in this box, I was really excited about it. It's the blush palette. I've never gotten any of their palette blushes. So when I got this, I was pretty excited. Um, it has this mirror right over here and I don't want to blind you so I'm just going to flip it. Um, the colors look like this. As you can see, extremely beautiful colors and great for the winter months and also the summer which is this very bright um, pink color so as you can tell you can mix these colors and I'll swatch these for you very smooth very pigmented and um, gorgeous colors I really like this color on my skin tone um, I gear towards the more mauve darker colors on my cheeks um, because these tend to be a little bit more chalky on the face or on my face or skin tone but I just like this this is my preference for blush um, I would wear these I could mix these two colors and they look beautiful one is more of like a bubblegum pink a peach and then your mauve I do plan on using this as I travel because uh, you can't go wrong with these colors. These are just versatile colors that can be used and mixed. So I really like this palette. So the retail of this blush palette is $46. I know it sounds a little steep for a three palette blush, but if you think about it, it is $15 per blush, give or take a few cents or so. And 
that's the price of a going blush, high-end going blush. So is it worth it for that? It's pushing it a little bit, but um, the quality of the blushes are really nice. So normally in the boxes, they send like a little surprise gift or so. And for this one, they gave a little certificate for $50 off Rivet and Sway. Um, I guess they sell glasses and specs for women. That's neat. I just don't wear glasses, so I won't make any use out of this. Always, Starlux sends these gems which I absolutely love. These are my favorite thing to get in the box. And they sent a pretty good size gem. I just collect them. I put them in a the little jar. So I'm excited every time I get to add to my jar. So there is a little spoiler alert and it's December Starbox, which is going to contain a Pro palette. And the last one from last year looked like this. I'll link the video of this palette down below if you're interested in checking out December Starbox, um, especially if you plan on beginning to subscribe to them. This would be a great palette to start off with. So definitely, if you're interested in the palette, make sure you sign up before December 10th because this is a great value. It is $99 valued. Palette. I'm excited to know what the next palette is going to be for this year. I hope that it's not quite as bold as this one since I already have the bolder colors. Um, hopefully it's a little bit more neutral and um, something I can work with daily. So I'm pretty excited about the December Starbucks. I'll show you the November one when I do get it. So that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed this review and I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!